In this video, we are checking out one of the best aquascaping stores in the UK, Horizon Aquatics. Exactly one year ago, I did a tour of this place as well, but since then, a lot has changed. So let's get started. Horizon Aquatics is located in the north of England, quite close to Newcastle. Last year I had the honor of giving a workshop here and this time I went back to see the workshop from Luis Navarro. Luis works for Seachem and he came all the way from Texas to share his knowledge and create a beautiful aquascape. The aquascaping is taking over the world and is becoming very popular. It doesn't matter where you go, you will find um, aquascaping galleries or people doing competitions. And you guys know how many contests there are nowadays. And it's amazing for somebody that, you know, that has been doing this for well over 30 years. For me, it's just sometimes I wake up in the middle of the night and I'm like, good God, where, where is this going? You know, it's, it's just crazy. Now let's begin with the tour. Horizon is quite a large store and has been open since 2019. The main focus is freshwater aquascaping, so they sell loads of hardscape, substrate, plants and equipment. But the best part has to be their amazing gallery. Here you will find all the inspiration you need to set up your own beautiful aquascape. At the time of filming, the gallery has 10 display things, but there's a few more in different places of the store. As soon as you enter Horizon, you are greeted by this first display tank. This one measures 90 cm from left to right, 60 cm front to back, and the height is 45 cm. I really love the hardscape in this one with that massive piece of wood. The main inhabitants are a group of blue-eyed Congo tetras and a spotted Congo puffer. Next up we will have a quick look at the different rooms. Obviously we have the showroom where you can find all the display things, the plants both potted and in vitro, and all the fish as well. Then we have a dry goods room, this one kind of speaks for itself. We have a nano room, here you can find all the shrimp, nano fish and betas. And of course we have a hardscape room as well. Here you can find loads of different types of wood and rocks and there's a dojo as well, so you can practice some layouts before you purchase anything. Now let's have a closer look at all the display things in the gallery. First up we have a beautiful Nano. This one was made by Charlotte who works at Horizon. This one is packed with colorful stems and different types of bush of Lander. The fish are exclamation point Rasbora and the shrimp are Santa Claus Caridina. Next to that we have a very new display. This one will be a beautiful Dutch style layout but it will need some more time to grow in. By the way, a lot of the display tanks in this gallery have their own build video as well. So if you want to see more of these tanks, I suggest you check out the Horizon Aquatics YouTube channel. Moving on to a 60cm aquarium. This is an ADA Cube Garden 60PE. So a little bit more space front to back compared to a standard 60P. This one is just over 2 months old and already looks amazing. The fish are black line rasboras, checkerboard cichlids and a few others. Moving on to a bigger tank, this is an ADA 90p, so roughly 180 liters. This one was made by James, the co-owner of Horizon. He actually used a few different types of wood mixed together, which is usually a no-go with aquascaping, but here it worked out very well. Lots of colorful stems, green neon tetras, and I think these are bleeding heart tetras, but I'm not sure. Next up we have an Iwagumi, and this one was made by none other than Tommy from Green Aqua. He did a workshop at Horizon a couple months ago, and that video is on the Green Aqua YouTube channel. What I love about this one is the carpet. This is a Latin Hydro Piper carpeting plant that you don't see many people use these days. Next to Tommy's layout we have another big tank, but I didn't get much footage from this one because the light screen is messing up the frames and causing these flickering images. So let's move on to this one. 
This tank is pretty cool because it's one of the few low tech or no CO2 displays in the store. There is a drop checker in the tank, but that's just to show the blue color. So here's proof that you can have a beautiful tank without CO2, you just need to choose the right plants. Here they use lots of moss, bulbitis, java fern and boos. I didn't get much footage of this next tank either, because the fern was blocking a lot of the light. So if you want to see more of this layout, check out the Horizon Aquatics YouTube channel. Then we have two left. The next one is an Oasis Cape Line 60. This one was made by Rachel Ellis. Rachel also has a YouTube channel and if you watch her videos, then this cape probably looks familiar. I love the triangular layout and all the contrasting colors. Then the last one is absolutely amazing. It's hard to pick a favorite, but this one is really up my alley. Another 60 centimeter tank with an island style layout so we have a carpet of Monte Carlo and then basically a bouquet with different stem plants. The colors are really popping in here and I love the Tucano Tetras as well. So that was it for this store tour. If you ever get the chance to visit this place, I highly recommend it. For now, this is it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.